When it comes to exercise for blood sugar regulation, we may be getting it wrong, according to a small study published recently showing that different exercises had different effects on blood sugar regulations. This has implications for brain health and overall health. I'm Dr. Austin Perlmutter. If you care about your health, follow this channel. Today, we're talking about a small study in overweight men where they looked at the effects of different types of exercise to offset the effects of being sedentary. Now, they had one group of men basically sit around for eight and a half half hours, which is pretty typical for what most people are doing, unfortunately, in the United States in a given day. Another group of men were allowed to do a 30-minute walk at one time during this eight and a half hour window. Another group of men every 45 minutes were able to do a three minute walk. And then the last group of men every 45 minutes did about 10 body weight squats. And what they looked at here were the effects of these different types of exercises on these markers of blood sugar, specifically the area under the curve for blood sugar. What they found were really two important things. The first is that doing these exercise snacks, so either these squats or these short walks, was better for regulating blood sugar than doing the one 30-minute walk in this eight and a half hour period. And the other thing they found is that the blood sugar regulation correlated with activation of the gluteus maximus as well as the quadriceps muscles, suggesting that activating those muscle groups may be key to the blood sugar regulation. What do I take away from this? It may be more optimal to do repeated snacks of exercise throughout the day than just doing one chunk of exercise at the start or at the end of your workday. Now, that may not always be incredibly feasible for everybody, but what I love about this study is they looked at different forms of exercise snacks. So whether it's doing a couple of squats each day or getting a short walk in every little bit, the bottom line is that your body seems to benefit specifically from a metabolic perspective from getting these exercise snacks in. And that may have implications for brain health because we know that metabolism and brain health are tightly linked. For more information like this, make sure you're following my channel. I'm Dr. Austin Perlmutter, and I'll talk to you again.